Hello, Anki Spondy people. So today is day one after my surgery. Yesterday I had my big toe fused and then they broke the three bones, well, three toes next to it because they had to make room for a nerve, um, like a little benign tumor that was growing in my nerve, which is called Morton's neuroma. Anyway, fun times. Um, the funny thing is I went to the doctor thinking I just needed orthotics and turns out both of my feet needed major surgery. So I'm just going to do one at a time. Um, but I will track it for you in case you need anything like this done. Um, the doctor was telling me that he no longer removes the, the uh, Morton's neuroma because he finds it grows back. So they do it this way. They may, they break the toes and make room for it. Anyway, I'm going to have ugly ass feet when this is done, but at least I'll be uh, not in as much pain because it kind of felt like I was stepping on shards of glass every once in a while from the nerve pain. And then what happened is 20 years ago, I had my big toe joints removed and the space in between formed a fake joint with the um, scar tissue and the um, ligament in there. Just And it, I was able to move it after about six months. But they did warn me that in about 20 years, which is now, that I would need to get it fused because what happened is the space closed itself up again. The two bones were touching and became arthritic. So anyhow, back to new adventures. So I chose my left foot first because then I can still drive for work. Um, because of COVID, I haven't been out there meeting my customers and I figured I should really do that. And then um, probably December or January, I will do the other foot. So here's a taking a look at my, what my foot looks like. There's my big giant cast and I do have one of those air casts on order, but I have to keep this thing on for a little bit. I'll keep you posted. Um, so far, it's pretty good. I think because after my neck surgery was such a horrendous recovery um, that this seems like small potatoes in comparison, but um, I'm also taking a lot of good pain meds right now. So anyway, we'll see. I'll keep you posted and uh, stay safe out there.